Charcoal is among the oldest of drying mediums, with cave drawings in France created about 37,000 years ago. Some of these early charcoal drawings depict buffalo, ibex, and horse, and they were created using burnt pieces of pine. It is believed that these drawings may have had religious and spiritual significance to the Ice Age artists who made them. Charcoal can come in several different forms. In this tutorial, we'll use vine charcoal and compressed charcoal, both of which are easily found at your local art and craft store. Vine charcoal is soft. When you press it to paper, you will notice immediately how it crumbles into powder. For this reason, it's also very workable and can be lifted easily with an eraser. You can buy vine charcoal with various hardness levels. Softer vine charcoal will yield a darker, richer black. Compressed charcoal is much harder than vine charcoal. It also comes in various levels of hardness, with softer charcoal leaving darker marks. Compressed charcoal is more permanent than vine charcoal and much more difficult to erase. I like to start drawings with a layer of vine charcoal and use compressed charcoal on top to add fine details. Let's talk about erasers. You can use a white eraser and or a kneaded eraser. Some people also like to use pink pearl erasers when using charcoal. I prefer kneaded erasers as they don't leave flakes behind. The kneaded eraser can also be molded to an edge or fine point, and it can be used as a drawing tool, lifting away vine charcoal to make marks. In this video, I use Strathmore charcoal paper, which has a beautiful texture. You can also use newsprint, watercolor paper, or Strathmore drawing paper. It should be a paper with some texture or tooth. Charcoal doesn't stick as well to smoother, more slippery papers. What is value? Value refers to light or darkness. To see value, it's helpful to work first in black and white, as with charcoal. To make a value scale, start with vine charcoal and create five boxes side by side. Press hard in the first box and make it as dark as possible. Let each box thereafter be a little bit lighter than the one before it. To make a lighter value, press lightly with the charcoal. Remember, the white of your page is a value. In your drawings, you should think about leaving the white of the page in the lightest areas. Create a value scale with compressed charcoal as well, and notice the difference in firmness and texture. Your eraser is another drawing tool. It's not only for getting rid of mistakes, it's also for lifting charcoal away to make white marks. Test your eraser on the value scales by lifting away a diagonal line in each box. It will be easier to erase the vine charcoal than it is to erase compressed charcoal. You may also notice a difference between the kneaded eraser and the white eraser, so do a test with both of these. Although this video focuses a great deal on building skills, we hope this three-part series will, in its entirety, convey the power of the arts in facilitating a heart response to the world around us. For this reason, you may wish to base your charcoal drawing on a wildfire in your area, or one which has affected you or your loved ones, near or far. The drawing need not strictly illustrate wildfire, but can also encompass other aspects of your experience with wildfire. Drawing provides us with moments of quiet reflection and meditation. You can use such moments to process your own thoughts, feelings, and responses to the large wildfires which have occurred recently. To fully appreciate such meditative moments, we recommend finding a calm space turning off all devices, and taking five minutes to close your eyes and clear the mind 
before beginning your drawing. Now we'll start the demo. Today I'm drawing a forest fire using a stock photo as reference. I'll start with vine charcoal, using the tip and edge to lay down layers of darkness, and taking care to leave areas of white to represent flames. I'll also use the kneaded eraser to lift away vine charcoal and create the illusion of grass and flame. Once you're satisfied with an initial layer of vine charcoal, use the compressed charcoal to add fine details. When your drawing is complete, you'll want to preserve it with a fixative spray, which will keep it from smudging. I hope you enjoyed this exploration of value in charcoal drawing. Remember that the concept of value applies to all drawing mediums, not only charcoal. That includes pencil and ink, so you can take what you learned in this short video and apply it to all your drawings.